Hi YouTube, Tamara here, and I am very hot, so if you hear a whirling in the background, that is my fan. Very sorry, but I'm super duper hot. It has been a very exciting week, and I hope that you've been able to keep up with our Project Right Tube, but if you haven't, I'm going to tell you about what has happened this week in just one moment. But before I do, you may not already know, but I am the editor and co-founder of The Reverie Journal. This is an online journal where we feature poets, find publishing opportunities, give writing prompts, talk about general poetry stuff, etc. It's our one year anniversary and part of that celebration is that we released our first collection yesterday, issue one. And it's going to be, for a limited time, free. Even when it's not free, the digital version will be 99 cents and for a paper copy it'll be $6.99. It is a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful work and I am extremely proud of it and I'm pleased to be able to offer it to the world for you to see and I will link it up here and in the downstairs for you to go check it out and yes so that is my big news. In case you don't remember Project Write Tube is this project that I and 11 other lovely writers on YouTube are putting out together. Monday, Wednesday, Friday of this month there will be a different writer answering one question that's related to NaNoWriMo, which is National Novel Writing Month, or writing in general. I'm super hyped and I have been and this is proceeding in excellent, excellent ways. I hope that you will check out these videos and see what I'm talking about. Our, our first person of the week, Kelly Sheridan. She is a writer and an editor. She's also part of the Word Nerds projects, and she had this to say about to nano or not to nano. That was the question. In the past, I've definitely heard some people criticize the whole idea behind National Novel Writing Month, mainly that it emphasizes quantity over quality. But really, nano rimo is what you make. If you are kind of on the fence of whether or not you should do nano this year, or you know someone who's in that kind of boat. You should check out this video, it might give you that extra little nudge you need. Our second video of this week was from Burgess Taylor, and she talked about how do you find your nano ideas. She gave some really concrete examples of some different processes that you can go through to kind of narrow down your ideas. So this is one of the things that she had to say. Number three that you're passionate enough about the idea that you are willing and able to spend the next 30 days of November writing 1,667 words a day for NaNoWriMo. That's a hell of a lot of words and requires a lot of dedication, passion, willpower, and coffee. Definitely coffee. I love the advice that she gave and I personally needed the advice because I wasn't really sure what I was going to do with the NaNo, you know what I mean? But uh. I think I'm at a better place now. So. And then our third person was Alex from Words Made. She answered the question, how do you find the motivation? Or a YouTuber or a writer, whether you participate in Nano or not, I think that motivation can be a real problem for creatives. In all of my years being someone who makes things, particularly someone who makes things on the internet, I have developed a series of tips to help me stay motivated. My second tip for staying motivated is to join a group. I love the advice that she had to give as well. Graded, I am totally biased. I love all these women and all the things that they do. But you should check out these videos, get a little bit of nano perspective, and get into the mood, cause it's next month. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Well, I am metal 
I am melting into a puddle of yuck. So I'm going to keep this short and sweet. I hope that you've had a great week. I'll be back next Saturday with another wrap up for you to check out. Also, there's a link up here for the playlist. I'll be adding videos to the playlist as they come up. And of course, at the end, you'll have the entire collection waiting just for you. I'm going to see you next week. I have a, a box unwrapping and I'm going to do a couple other videos, little chats. I haven't done these in a while with y'all and I miss it. Remember, my name is Tamara, and this is where I like to hang out. I put out videos each week, and they're about writing books, author interviews, etc., and poetry, which I'm going to do more of that this month. I promise, promise, promise. So, if you haven't already and you like to, please subscribe, click like if you like this, and share because I want everyone to know about this this cool stuff. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.